Dr. Sai Gehani researched 111 confirmed cases of coronavirus in the country and that majority of them were persons who came in from overseas. He said the highest number of confirmed cases are in Lagos and Abuja. We have recorded 111 confirmed cases of COVID-19 in Nigeria, of which 68 are in Lagos, 21 in the Federal Capital Territory, 7 in Oyo, 3 in Ogun, 2 in Bauchi, 2 in Edo, 2 in Oshun, 2 in Enugu, and 1 each in Benue, Ekiti, Kaduna, and River States. Chief of Staff to the President, Malam Abakiari, has revealed that he has made a private arrangement to be transferred to Lagos for further treatments. In a message, Kiare, who said he was feeling well, pointed out that he had followed all the protocols government had announced to self-isolate and quarantine. Abakiari tested positive to coronavirus after being tested by Nigerian Center for Disease Control and was placed on self-isolation. Oyo State Governor Sherry Makinde has tested positive for coronavirus. He made the announcement via his Twitter handle. He said he has received his COVID-19 confirmation test results, which proved positive and will continue to self-isolate. Meanwhile, Lagos State Government on Monday discharged five coronavirus patients from the Infectious Disease Center, Yaba Mainland Hospital, bringing to eight the total number of discharged patients from the center. Elsewhere, Ogu State on Monday inaugurated 128-bed isolation center in Ikene, Ogu State. Governor Dakbo Abiodu, while inaugurating the facility, said the center is part of government's efforts at curtailing the spread of the pandemic in the states. The state has also mapped the following health facilities that could be easily prepared and deployed in an unlikely event of the existing 300 bed spaces being exhausted. These include the 523 primary health care facilities, 42 secondary facilities, three tertiary facilities and 690 private health facilities with 7,082 health care workers including 531 doctors and 2,000 206 notices across the 20 local governments in the state. In a related development, the state government has placed a total ban on all markets across the state with effect from Tuesday 31st March 2020. the State Commissioner for Information and Orientation, Donald Ojogo, said the directive followed the observation that residents have flagrantly disobeyed the partial closure earlier put in place as a potent measure to avoid the spread of coronavirus. That total closure of the market the directive that has all been given by the state government will definitely take a toll on all, but it is going to be a, a temporary thing. The Nigerian Center for Disease Control says it is following up with about 6,000 people suspected to have had contact with the 111 confirmed cases of coronavirus in the country. Director General of the agency, Dr. Chigwe Ehenkwezu, said these few weeks will help the teams to have access to the contacts living around Lagos and FCT. Also, Adamawa State Governor Amadou Fintiri has ordered a two-week lockdown of the state as part of measures to check the spread of coronavirus. According to the Chief Press Secretary to the State Governor, Governor Fintiri said the painful decision was necessary to save lives in the state, noting that the directive takes effect from Tuesday 31st of March. Rosalind Evorame reporting.